What's up guys? So today I'm doing something a little bit for a video today, so today I thought I'd look on my old Facebook today because you know how sometimes people stalk other people's Facebook profile pictures, you know, for a little bit of a nosy and then you often have to be really careful not to accidentally press the like button or add someone as a friend because you just wanted to stalk the Facebook. Well, I thought today I would stalk my own Facebook today because I have Facebook since I was about nine, which is very naughty because you're supposed to be about 13 years old to have Facebook but I first got my Facebook account when I was about eight or nine so with that comes many cringy Facebook moments. So I was searching through my Facebook the other day like trying to look at like things like my name on. I actually deleted the majority of the cringy posts I used to post because they were so cringy that I could not have them on there anymore. Like I couldn't have people like be friends with me on Facebook and like scroll all the way down to like posts from like 2012. But I actually still kept a lot of them so they're still old Facebook posts from me floating around and they are just as cringy is the ones I deleted. So yeah, if you guys are excited, I'm going to be looking at the video, this is Ralph Child do all the things as always, and let's just get into it, shall we? Let's just open up my laptop and um, look at these Facebook posts, shall we? Because I am um, cringing right now. Okay, so I've just got my laptop here right now, so I screenshotted all my old Facebook posts and just saved them onto my laptop, so this shall be really fun. So first up is this post from the 2nd of December 2012, so I first got my Facebook account in November 2012, so I was fairly new to Facebook at that point, so, and I was so proud of having my own Facebook account, like to the point where I would post every single hour of every single day. It was kind of like my proud and joy like I would just literally post every single day so first up is this post which says just broke up for Christmas woo explanation mark 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 like my profile picture her huh? best in the life xxx explanation mark now this is a proper summer now this was referring to a profile picture where I I made on like Microsoft Word and there was like collaging like pictures which I can't show because it has other people in it and I screenshot today and then like set it up my Facebook profile picture. It was during the summer and it was basically so lame. Plus also this post makes no sense. Like what the hell is best in the life XXX? When am I trapped? There's nothing like story in bed at 9.05. Okay, that makes no sense, but I also know what I'm referring to, so I used to always get a bedtime story, like I'd go to bed and I'd always get a story read to me before I had to obviously go to sleep. And it would always be something like Tracy Beaker or any sort of like Jacqueline Wilson book, because I used to be obsessed with Jacqueline Wilson books back in the day. I guess that night I didn't have a story read to me, so um, I think I was sulking that I didn't get a story read to me. But I don't know what I mean by when am I trapped? That makes no sense. Okay, so the next post is a whole like essay. So I spent a long time making this fantastic essay of a post. So this school year has gone from September to December holidays with Sim City Social on Facebook. I've now got the Sims Free Master Suite stuff on something computer and a new bedroom lamp. My bedroom is gonna be dreaming for 2013 with my new television which is go gonna be in my room. First of all, I spelt witch, as in like a witch, not like witches. Gonna be in my bedroom and a new carpet 2013. Here I come for my new wishing star. From a person now, la la the tea follower of 2013. That makes no sense. I think um, I'm on about like the old Facebook games so I used to be obsessed with playing games on Facebook. Now I think there's still things on Facebook like Candy Crush because I play Candy Crush like all the time. But I remember Facebook back in the day used to have so many games such as like I don't know do you remember Megapolis is, was that a game? I think it was. I used to be obsessed with playing those games so I think that's what I was referring to when I um, said Sim City Social on Facebook, so and I presume I must have got a new television and also a new carpet in 2013. So I guess that's running again. Just watch it, my designer clothes and my new dream bedroom. He 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 he. That makes no sense. Enjoyed my new game Sims Free Master Sweet stuff. I codent. So 
What is that spelling? Without spending my money from the money box. Oh my god, these are so cringy. Like, literally, first world problems. Like, so what if I can't spend my money on The Sims? I added a new photo in my timeline just because it used to be my desktop background. Okay. No one cares. Burned shoulder. Having to have two days off school. Okay, so I remember this now. So I used to have a trampoline years ago and I used to bounce on that thing like literally every single day. Like if I didn't have school or if I was on holiday or it was the weekend, then I'd wake up super early and then I would literally just bounce on that thing all day. And so I remember this actually being sunburned. So it was a really hot summer. And I think it was like a week where it was just like all the days of the week were just like really hot. And I used to hate wearing sun cream. Like I hate wearing sun cream now like I don't like the way like you have greasy sun cream on your skin down your neck like I often don't wear sun cream because I barely ever sunburn like so I think this time and also another time as well which I can't remember were the only times when I've ever had sunburn like for example like this year where we had like the hottest summer practically ever I still went for like walks outside without sun cream and I still never got sunburned so, like so why I don't really burn that easily but I think what happened was that I was bound on the trampoline and the way the trampoline was situated was like situated in front of like the sun so the sun was like beaming down on the trampoline and I was bouncing on my back so the sun would beam down onto my neck and on my back and then I think I woke up one morning and my shoulder and my back really hurt and so that was sunburn so I had been burnt in the sun and if you've ever had like sunburn before especially on your shoulder and on your back as well you know that sunburn is literally no joke like it hurts so much like it's the most uncomfortable feeling in the world like it's the most uncomfortable thing ever so that taught me a lesson and that is to wear sun cream and i think that's all for my old cringy facebook posts but i think there's like many more but they were deleted so those were the only interesting ones and really cringy ones that i could scoop out out. And so lesson learned hopefully for you guys is that never download Facebook or have a Facebook account when you're not 13 or of an age where you can post on Facebook because you'll just end up posting cringy things like those and you'll regret it for the rest of your life and you have to look back on all these posts when people like stalk your Facebook. But I hope you guys liked watching this video. If you have, don't forget to look like this video, subscribe, so I'll do all the things. I shall see you guys very soon with some more fun videos. And so yeah, um, what else is to say? There's nothing else to say, so it's goodbye.